Hi everyone, Lucas from LucasGisbertPhotography.com and in this video I'm going to give you my review of the Nifty Mini Drive. Now if you buy yourself a MacBook Pro or a MacBook and you buy this on the Apple Store, you will quickly realize that adding a few add-ons to the base model which you took can cost you a bit of money and a lot of people I know say that uh, track up are now cheap. But in theory, you know, when you go through the system, well, it can become quite expensive. Uh, let me show you an example here. Um, on the MacBook Store, uh, you can see that adding uh, the extra option for the drive costs you an extra $500. Now, $500 can buy lots of uh, extra external hard drive like this, and most people will actually do this. They'll go for the lower model if they can really afford that higher model and just go for external hard drive. The problem with those hard drives is that, well, they take space, there is cables, you have to keep it with you. And they're not always practical, let's be honest. So what Nifty Drive has actually done, it's come out with a product which is pretty cool, is uh, something which will hold into your um, MacBook without taking any space. So let me show you how this works. So this is the box. So when you unbox it, you will see that uh, it comes with, you know, some uh, little paper, but it's pretty straightforward, so there is no actual uh, instruction apart from at the back of it. Inside you will find the nifty drive which will stick into the SD slot, the micro SD which will fit then inside the nifty drive and then you'll have the little clip uh, which will allow you to take the nifty drive off when you need to. So uh, the way it works is pretty simple, let me show you. So what you do is you just uh, put the micro SD into the nifty drive and stick it inside the, the MacBook and you're pretty much done and that will read into your MacBook like if it was an SD card. Now I personally went for the 128 gig mod um, SD card, a micro SD, but it can comes it comes automatically with a 2 gig. I actually got a 4 gig when I ordered it but uh, I got an extra 128 gigs so it gives me uh, the maximum space and that will be the maximum you can get. Uh, as you can see you know you unclip and clip it pretty easily. The only thing that kind of bothered me about this product is that if you use the SD slot a lot, like I personally do quite a bit, uh, you kind of gonna end up by taking in and out quite often. So it's maybe something you need to think about before uh, you're using it. So I think it's a great, great backup. So for example, if you're going on travel and you need to have a second storage working like RED, where you have a copy on your MacBook and a copy on the drive, that works really really well it also works well for backup i personally use it for my backup so for my uh, time machine so what we'll do is it will back up with that little drive uh, apart from this i, I think it's, a, it's an excellent product i think it's really really clever um, and you know in future we probably will see that you know you'll be able to put a terabyte micro sd in there so that is something that could happen you know in the next few maybe few years you know very clever so i put all the details down below if you have any questions please don't hesitate to contact me but you can also contact them uh, if you have some technical problem or technical uh, question you have and that is pretty much it so thanks for watching cheers see ya